Hi guys, this is uh, Le Pumps before and after fame hairstyle and the process that he went through. This is of course before his fame when he had the little puff, what they call it as like the top boy cut back then, uh, whatever they call it, I don't know, three years ago, you know what I'm saying, he started growing out his dreads. I think he went to dreads automatically when he became famous. I think it's because it's easy maintenance wise and also it's like... It's like Lil Wayne, I used to have dreads, like a lot of rappers and just like to be, to have a straight hair and actually to step out in this, in this game is actually a bold move because he, he didn't, I bet he didn't know like how it was going to look, how, how long he going to come because from the start, it didn't look good. You know what I'm saying? Like at this like beginning stage, I don't think it looked good. Like later on, whenever he started maintaining it, that thing, that's when it looked good. Like right here, he started getting some. Uh, they say he had he that extension or whatever. He might have. I think he grew it out though to where it's at right now. He might have had some extra hair to help him out stay where it's at though. And he kept on growing it out as you guys can tell, dyeing it a lot of different colors. And here's his Instagram basically where he started at about 2017 right there, February 18. And as you can see, he started dyeing out crazy different colors. It's just like just trying to be different in a way in the style and i think it became his style to have that type of hair dye a blonde and then a pink or something may 2017 right there uh his hair length grew so much uh but i feel like it just kept on that maintenance from two years to now i think there isn't much change that i've seen in his hair you guys can tell right here i think this is when he did the gucci gang or whatever song uh october right there and his hair i think is big part of who he is as a person that look crispy right there but uh and uh the color he went with the gucci color uh i think that that really stood out like that looks good right there like the way he had it from the bottom to the top it's like whenever he maintain it from 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 the from the roots of it i think it looks really dope with the fade and like or the little taper and stuff like that with the hairline that's when it started looking good and he braids it sometimes like that. That's a lot of look crispy. And I think he has extension right there. But his hair length went uh, from like eight inches from 2017 to start off to now. He went like to uh, maybe two 12 inches or so right there. Uh, looks like it was not maintained pretty good right there or right here. Let's see his hair. Yeah, it's just... It's just it's just hard to maintain it, of course, because because of the amount of new growth that he gets, or uh, just like it's straight, so it just easily comes out of his uh, his whole dread. And I'm not highly expert as as I am, or as I as you guys may think that I am in dreads, but I'm actually getting started to know exactly like hair types and hair dread styles and stuff like that. And from the looks of it, I think Lil Pump has one of the iconic dreads in in the in the rap game. And uh, to have it straight like that. And a lot of people ask me, can I have dreads? Can I have dreads? And I have straight hair. I mean, he had curly hair, not straight hair, but he has curly hair, but close to straight, but still he's able to do it. So I think anybody can do it as long as the maintenance is there. I think for whenever you come to a, a hair type like mine, I think it's easier to, to keep a locked because it's not, it's not a straight or curly hair. It's curly, but it looks a little bit more rougher, so it kind of like tangles up itself. Even when I, when I had it in Afro, it was always tangled up, no matter what I did, even after I brushed it, combed it. Right here, you guys can tell like he started doing more styles in 2018. This is March. Uh, he came a long way, you know, whenever he started, he, it did not look this good. You know what I'm saying? You guys sometimes give up and cut your hair early stage, but don't do that. Just keep on pushing it to where it's like, okay, at least I got some length now. I can decide if I want to keep it or not. Like Gunther the Great. Uh, right here, he he started dyeing a pretty blonde. And it looks it looked good. I think he might have had extension right there. It looks good when you dye it real blonde and, and the roots are black. Um, I think that's better than dyeing it different colors every time. You have a new video coming out or something like that <laughs> for you rappers, SoundCloud rappers. I give y'all this uh, this basic advice. This is this is very common sense. If you keep dyeing your hair, you're gonna damage your hair, man. Your hair is not gonna be good. As you guys can tell, his hair is is like somebody maintained his hair. 
Like, he pays somebody to maintain his hair. And it's still hard for him to keep up. You know what I'm saying? So you got to think about it. Okay, can I still do this while dyeing my hair, while doing all this by myself without nobody helping me? You might have a girl or a family member that can help me out, help you out, but you still got to work a schedule for it. And, yeah, as you guys can tell, like, as I go up, it's just like the year are getting close to where we're at today. And, uh... It's like his length is still the same. I think that's what I, that's what I'm saying. Like he cut he cuts it. He had an extension and then he took it out and he just like keeps it like that. But he don't grow with it. He don't grow it to where it's like really long, like Lil Wayne or anything like that. He just keeps it to where it's just that same size unless he needs to put an extension in it. An extension of becoming the new thing, the new wave for for a dread movement. Right here, you can see. He had it in a ponytail. This is April of this year, 2019. Looks like it's maintained pretty good. And I don't know. I've never seen him with that hair color before in any videos he did before. But this is my first time actually seeing that on his page. I don't follow him or anything like that. But it's just crazy how it looks. For a, a for a hair type or a hair texture like his, it actually looks pretty good. It don't look bad at all. It don't look like it's it's very wild. You know what I'm saying? Because like I said, if he maintain it and he keep putting it on braids, like that looks cool right there. Braids and other st styles. Man, Shaq's hand look big. Uh, that you will see. You will see what the what 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 exactly needs to look like. Like a lot of people just give up on early stage and they don't see the full max growth and, and and stuff to it. And as you guys can tell right here, this is like very recent. And not really maintained pretty good. He looks like he's just chilling. But yeah, that's it for the video, y'all. Till next time. Right.